So guys, for the first method, you're gonna head over to search and type in Xbox. Now you're gonna find the Xbox application, you're gonna right click on it, and then click on app settings. And then once you're on this, you're gonna scroll down, and then click on terminate, you're gonna scroll down a bit more, and then click on reset, and then click on reset again. Wait for this to load, see if that works for you. For the second method, you're gonna head over to search and type in check for updates, click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna click on check for updates, make sure that your computer is fully up to date. If that's still not working, for the next method, you're gonna head over to search and type in date and time settings, click on it. And then once you're on this, make sure that your time zone is correct, make sure you have set time automatically turned on. Now you're gonna scroll down and then click on sync now. Make sure that your date and time has been fully synced up. For the last method, you're gonna head over to search and type in add remove programs, click on it. And then once you're on this, you're gonna find Xbox. So we're gonna scroll down till we find Xbox. Here it is. You're gonna click on the three dots and then click on uninstall and then click on uninstall again. You want to uninstall the Xbox application. And then once you uninstall that, you're gonna head over to search again and type in Microsoft Store. Click on it. And then once you're on the Microsoft Store, you're gonna search for Xbox. Click on it. And you now to find the Xbox application, click on it. And now you just wanna install it again. This should now fix your problem. If not, then just restart your computer and then this should not fix your problem.